The following questions and answers are based on the book Teach Processing Technology in the Tropics. Please note that while every effort has been made to ensure the accuracy of the information, errors may still be present. If you find any inaccuracies or have additional insights, please feel free to comment down below. Your feedback is highly appreciated and will help improve the quality of the content. Chapter 12. Additives What is the definition of a food additive according to the Philippine Food and Drug Administration, 1987? A. A natural substance added to food for flavor. B. Any substance that affects the characteristics of any food. C. A preservative used in food packaging. D. A nutrient added to enhance food quality. What is the definition of a food additive according to the Philippine Food and Drug Administration, 1987? Answer. B. Any substance that affects the characteristics of any food. According to the Philippine FDA, a food additive is any substance intended to become a component of or affect the characteristics of any food. Which organization supervises the use of food additives in the Philippines? A. Department of Agriculture B. Bureau of Food and Drugs C. National Food Authority D. Department of Trade and Industry which organization supervises the use of food additives in the Philippines? B. Bureau of Food and Drugs Bureau of Food and Drugs under the Department of Health is responsible for supervising the use of food additives to ensure consumer safety. What is, the, what is one of the primary purposes of food additives? A. To increase food production B. To enhance the appearance of food for consumer attraction C. To reduce the cost of food production. D. To increase the shelf life of packaging. What is one of the primary purposes of food additives? Answer. B. To enhance the appearance of food for consumer attraction. One of the purposes is to make food attractive to consumers in a way that prevents deception. Which code numbers are assigned to coloring agents in the international numbering system for food additives? A. 100 to 199 B. 200 to 299 C. 300 to 399 D. 400 to 499 Which code numbers are assigned to coloring agents in the International Numbering System for Food Additives? Answer A. 100 to 199 Coloring agents have code numbers between 100 to 199 in the International Numbering System. What does the prefix E on food labels indicate? A. The additive is an enzyme. B. The additive is a natural extract. C. The additive is approved with the European community. D. The additive is an emulsifier. What does the prefix E on food labels indicate? Answer. C. The additive is approved by the European community. The prefix E indicates that the additive has been approved by the European community. Which type of additive includes antibiotics? A. Preservatives B. Flavor enhancers C. Stabilizers D. Antioxidants Which type of additive includes antibiotics? Answer A. Preservatives Antibiotics are considered preservatives because they help control the growth of spoilage organisms. What is the recommended maximum residue limit, MRL, of oxytetracycline for muscle? A. 0.1 mg per kilogram B. 0.2 mg per kilogram C. 0.3 mg per kilogram D. 0.6 mg per kilogram What is the recommended maximum residue limit, MRL, of oxytetracycline for muscle? Answer A. 0.1 mg per kilogram the Joint FAO and WHO Expert Com Committee on Food Additives recommend 0.1 mg per kilogram as the MRL for muscle. Which type of microorganism produces antibiotics used in aquatic products? A. Algae B. Streptomyces C. Fungi D. Protozoa 
which type of microorganism produces antibiotics used in aquatic products. Answer. B. Streptomyces. Streptomyces species as a, such as Streptomyces aureopatiens and Streptomyces stromosus produce antibiotics like chlorotetracycline and oxytetracycline. Which code or numbers are assigned to flavor enhancers in the international numbering system for flea additives? A. 100 to 199 B. 200 to 299 C. 600 to 699 D. 900 to 999 which code numbers are assigned to flavor enhancers in the international numbering system for food additives? Answer C. 600 to 699. Flavor enhancers have code numbers between 600 to 699 in the international numbering system. Which of the following is not a purpose of food additives according to Lagua et al. 1977? A. Maintenance of nutritional quality. B. Improvement of keeping quality. C. Making food less attractive. D. Providing essential aids in food processing. Which of the following is not a purpose of food additives according to Lago et al.? Answer. C. Making food less attractive. One purpose is to make food attractive, not less attractive to consumers. What type of food additive is used to maintain nutritional quality? A. Preservatives B. Nutrient Supplements C. Flavor Enhancers D. Emulsifiers What type of food additive is used to maintain nutritional quality? Answer B. Nutrient Supplements Nutrient supplements are added to maintain or improve the nutritional quality of food. Which code numbers are assigned to antioxidants and food acids in the international numbering system for food additives? A. 100-199 B. 200 to 299, C. 300 to 399, four, or D. 400 to 499. Which code numbers are assigned to antioxidants and food acids in the international numbering system for food additives? Answer C. 300 to 399. Antioxidants and food acids have code numbers between 300 to 399. Which of the following substances is used as an antibiotic in aquatic products? A. Chlorotetracycline B. Sodium Chloride C. Ascorbic Acid D. Agar Agar Which of the following substances is used as an antibiotic in aquatic products? Answer A. Chlorotetracycline Chlorotetracycline produced by Streptomyces aureofaciens is used as an antibiotic in aquatic products. How should antibiotics be applied to aquatic foods? A without refrigeration b in combination with refrigeration c with added sugars d at room temperature how should antibiotics be applied in aquatic foods answer b in combination with refrigeration antibiotics must be used in combination with refrigeration to control spoilage organisms effectively what is the preferred residue level of antibiotics in food at the time of consumption? A. High residue B. Moderate residue C. Little or no residue D. There is always no residue of antibiotics in food What is the preferred residue level of antibiotics in food at the time of consumption? Answer C. Little or no residue it is preferred that little or no antibiotic residue is left in the food at the time of consumption.